In this video, I'll show you how to make a video circular in Camtasia. This works for any video that you have or even the webcam videos that you do when creating tutorials in Camtasia 2020 and beyond. Previous versions of Camtasia for Windows did not support adding a mask like uh, what we had in uh, Camtasia for Mac, but with the recent version, the Camtasia 2020 version, it's possible to have a circular talking head video or make any video circular in Camtasia. This is pretty awesome and I'm going to show you how you do it step by step. Follow along. Hi, my name is David and if you get any value from the video that you watch and you like the content, kindly consider subscribing, liking the video and sharing it with your friends so that we can all learn together. I already have my Camtasia 2020 open. I have a blank project and all we need to do first is to just add a video to the timeline. So just add your video to the timeline, just import the video, our video is imported, and then we need to put it here on the timeline. So from the media bin to the timeline, let's say we want it on track one, and I can just uh, right click and remove all empty tracks so that uh, uh, there's nothing showing up here. So I've got a video that's rectangular, but let's say all we wanted to have is a talking head video or just a circular video. So how do you do that? It's pretty simple and Camtasia has done this and made this super easy. So what do you do? We'll go up to the annotations and from the annotations, all we need is a circular shape. I'm going to go annotation shapes and then select the bold shapes. And uh, I don't need any theme here, but just to drag and drop the circular shape. Now by default, this is the size that we get but we want to blow this up so that it fills the space that we want. Let's say we just need the talking head. So what we're going to do, let's first of all begin by dragging this to the end of our clip or to where we, we need it to get to. And once we're satisfied that this is where we, we need uh, the circle to end, then come to a video and just hold shift and the end uh, that you want to pull up and pull it up. Let's say up to there, then come to the other end, pull it, Pull it, there we go, and there we have it. It looks pretty good, it's a circle that's obscuring our face. So let's just say it's covering our face, that's good. So the one thing I'd note is that make sure that your subject doesn't move around in and out of the circle. Ensure that the circle is in place uh, or the person is stationary uh, when recording the video so that you don't have uh, the subject moving in and out of the circle. The next thing that we need to do is we need to come to this particular track section and you can notice we used to have the disable, an eye that used to disable the track and we also used to have a magnet or the lock, uh, this lock, but there's also a magnet. The magnet helps to reduce gaps from your uh, timeline or clips on your timeline. But what we're going to do is when you look at the eye, if you right click on it, you'll see the track mat mode. Currently is selected to none. They also have alpha, alpha invert, luminosity, luminosity invert, and we also have the track mat help. For this video, we're just going to use the alpha. If we click on alpha, that's what happens. We now have a good circular talking head video that we can use for our projects. Put it on the lower section and all that. So if we scroll down, we'll see I'm still in frame. Uh, this was maybe going to take two. I'm still in frame. Uh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Uh, so basically, that's how you do it. But that's not all. For these, you want to always have your shape, the one that you've uh, inverted, and the media grouped. So we'll need to select both clips, control, and just click on that, or just uh, drag your mouse while holding down the left so that it select both and right click or press on control G to group. And once you group, there's something I want you to notice is that this track remains with some sort of uh, dots in there. So always remember to right click and go to none for the track mat mode. And we'll have our video uh, in a circular shape. So that looks good. Uh, let's say we wanted it to be at the bottom, let's say uh, bottom right. Let's just drag and drop. 
uh, and you'll notice that it has a black uh, a black uh, the, vi the the video in is in a uh, black background but it's not black it's a transparent background so if we can just confirm that let's just drag and drop this uh, shape and move it to the end and then just blow it up uh, there we go and then blow it up to the end uh, we can change the tracks just move this down remove the track without anything and you can see that our track does not have a our video is not with a black background so it's it's pretty good uh, as it is so you can just uh, have it there uh, the good thing with this is that you can do a lot of things with these uh, circular head videos uh, you can do let's say interview style conversation videos for example if uh, I'm a subject and I clone myself or do another video I can do a video with maybe one head on this side and one head on the other side as I talk throughout uh, and maybe a script or something is going on in between here so the options are limitless and it's awesome that we can now do this inside Camtasia 2020 uh, and you can do this for any videos that you want to do uh, it's also another good practice let's say you are doing editing for zoom videos uh, you can have uh, the different uh, maybe interviews that you do the different speakers uh, maybe different circular videos just to spice up and uh, create emphasis and uh, keep people engaged throughout your videos so basically uh, that's how you create a circular talking head video or just make a video circular in Camtasia 2020 and beyond. Thank you for watching this video. If you got any value from this content, kindly consider subscribing to the channel, like the video and share it with your friends. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thank you for watching this video.